how much of the 30,000 per month that we're making is profit? So uh, that profit is a, is a weird and a vague kind of thing because the operator of a business can control the profit entirely. So for example, I don't really want any profit because we're reinvesting all of this into the land to continue building out the vision. And also if you have profit, then you have to pay tax on profit. So if you just use the profit, then you don't have to pay taxes and you're growing the vision. So that is our goal. Um, so if I wanted to, I could sit back and, you know, if you break that down, let's say, you know, we got, we were doing most of that revenue is also, by the way, coming from, uh, in our first years, we started doing uh, cabin rentals and retreats. And then we use that to reinvest into building out more of the farming aspect. And then now we're, we, you know, we're bringing uh, produce from our market garden to market and things like that. So it opens up, you use the most efficient revenue stream to then build and open up new uh, income streams and so on and, and continue building out the project. So you're diversified. Um, so that's what we help you do. But uh, yeah, if, if we really wanted to, we could sit back and probably uh, bring in like 50 to 70% profit uh, pretty easily while still having all of the staff that like automate like the whole thing. So we could just chill and, and, and make that money. But that's not what we're looking to do. The whole point is, is to really build that out. But um, if that was what you're looking to do, then you could 100% do that. Uh, you could probably achieve higher margins than that, depending on the model. Like we work with a bunch of different models. You could be a homesteader, you could be doing rentals, you could be doing retreats or workshops, you could be doing regenerative farming. So all of those things just have really different, uh, you know, profit margins depending on, on what you're doing and, and how efficient they are and things like that but those are all things that we map out in the course and, and help you really decide on what to start with first and then how to reinvest that effectively to start the next thing and so on and so forth so yeah